I think that because I was a very good student and did really well in school, I had this notion that people who do well in school, in particular if they do well in science, they should be doctors. I had no idea what I was getting into. I was completely overwhelmed by what a huge responsibility it was. And I really feel like I probably ignored my nature, which is to be more creative. Which is why I think it's this big deal in my life that I've been able to introduce making movies and um, doing something more creative in medicine. Because at the end of the day, I actually do really love the work that I do in medicine. I love uh, the intensive care profession. I am really committed to my patients. But the fact that I can also have this other side of me exist within medicine is so gratifying. My impressions of what private school would be was not accurate. When I went to the campus for an interview, I was stunned by how beautiful it was. I remember that very well. Havergal definitely uh, celebrates individual talents. And I was so supported. I was so, I had so much support in the form of teachers to say, oh, why don't you try this? Or why don't you try for this team? Or why don't you write for this? Or, and so you feel so empowered to try different things and excel. If you had some sort of fire in your belly about something, somebody would find you. It happened for me in ninth grade English. That was really my way into the extracurricular world of the school and expressing myself and you know being part of an organization and being passionate about something outside of classes. There wasn't one definition of success. And I think the way it helped me is it really made me feel good about myself. It made me feel capable. I think that if people push you a little bit in the direction you're already going but you're not really sure how to get there, it really, it's, it's, a, it's such a gift.